What's going on party people? So today I'm gonna to show you a compound lift that you can do for your biceps because curls, sorry, they're not a compound movement and you need a compound movement to move a lot of weight and you know get that the big muscle going. So with triceps, we have close grip put uh, close grip bench press, we have dips, both compound movements, both can uh, move a lot of weight, but for biceps we don't have that until now. So with this, we're gonna do a normal chin-up. Well, not a normal chin-up, because normal chin-up is back focused because you'll be pulling down like this and you kind of you squeeze your lats back here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a chin-up, but have your shoulders rotated to the front a little bit, and this will put more focus on your bicep. And you know, the grip is the same as you would for a normal chin-up. Again, just put your, instead of pulling your shoulders back like this to do it, to make it back focus, you're gonna keep your shoulders rounded in front of you, and just pull up. Just like that. Now, rip off sets of six to eight, 10, 12. If you can get to like 12 to 15 reps with this, then I would recommend adding weight, get a, get a dip belt like this, Wrap this around your waist, attach it to a uh, weight, and that weight that way. Uh, go in small increments, five, 10 pounds uh, to do that. Now, if you can't lift your body weight or you have cranky elbows, like I currently have right now, then this is not gonna be a good course of action because you're gonna put a lot of stress on your elbows. So this is what you can do. So if you have cranky elbows or you can't lift your weight, then you can do this. So just, I have my barbell hanging on my squat rack, uh, on just the clips, nothing spectacular. Uh, what you can do is, you know, set up normally like you would do a chin up, and just put your feet up like this. Don't rest your ass on the ground, because that's taking all the, the stress off your arms, uh, and obviously not lifting weight when your ass is on the ground. So you can do that. And then just do it normally. And what this does is it lightens the weight on your arms because you're supported by your feet on the ground. Um, and then if you want to make it a little bit harder, you can elevate your feet on the bench, which I can't do right now because it's holding the camera. But you know, just elevate your feet a little bit and it takes puts a little bit more pressure on your arms so you can focus it that way. But that's what you do if you have cranky elbows or you can't lift your body weight. But if you can lift your body weight, I recommend you go on a pull-up bar or something like that. Or if you're in the gym, you can do like the assisted pull-up and um, just do it like that and get your biceps going, all right?